take it with a pinch of salt. Maybe you've heard someone say to take it with a pinch of salt right after they've said something unbelievable. A friend might have told you something that seemed very exaggerated while another friend listening in whispered to you, take it with a pinch of salt. Taking it with a pinch of salt or to take with a pinch of salt means not to fully believe what you just heard, to be skeptical. The idiom reminds the listener that what was just said might have been exaggerated or only half true. If someone follows something they said with, take it with a pinch of salt, it means that he or she is telling you not to completely believe what was just said. Perhaps they do not believe it themselves, but are just telling you what they heard. Or maybe a friend tells you about another friend. Take everything she says with a pinch of salt. She tends to exaggerate. The question is, why does taking something with a pinch of salt mean not to completely believe something you hear. After all, a pinch of salt between two fingers is supposed to be put atop food. Salt makes bland food a lot easier to swallow. Indeed, since salt makes food a lot easier to swallow, or to eat. The idea is that salt should also make a half-truth or an exaggeration easier to swallow, that is, easier to believe. Speaking of making something easier to swallow due to a pinch of salt, hard to swallow is a common idiom meaning that something is true but hard to believe. As you can see, since eating is a big part of our lives, many words related to eating have become allusions for thoughts and ideas. If you take news with a pinch of salt, it makes it easier to swallow. It's hard to swallow bad news, but you'll eventually have to come to terms with it. And if you want to think about something, you'll need to let it digest. Information on the historical origin of take it with a pinch of salt is scant, but many online sources give credit to Pliny the Elder, a Roman author. Pliny the Elder was writing the first encyclopedia and included in it a recipe for a cure to poison which included a grain of salt. Over time, that single grain turned into a pinch. The next time you have a juicy piece of gossip to tell a friend, but are not sure if it's true, let them know. I'm not sure if this is true or not, but take it with a pinch of salt. Maybe your cousin overheard the grown-ups talking about something but wasn't sure. Take this with a pinch of salt but I heard our parents talking about taking a vacation together. So, the next time you hear someone advise you to take it with a pinch of salt, 
make sure you don't put all your faith in what was said.